Hello, and welcome to another Imagine It Tech Tip. My name is Dana Rice. I am a Civil 3D certified professional and an AutoCAD certified instructor. In today's video, I will show you the Earthworks Plan Production Command in Civil 3D. Civil 3D has a command that will create a complete earthwork construction plan. Each grid will show the cut and fill difference as well as volumes between two tin surfaces. Several layers are created by this command. The user has the ability to customize layer and text settings as well as create a layer filter for complete control of all earthwork layers. So now let me jump into Civil 3D to show you this command. The command is located on the Analyze ribbon. And here is its icon right here, Earthwork Plan Production. This drawing has two surfaces, the existing site surface, as well as a baseball finish grade surface. I will perform the Earthworks Plan Production command analyzing those two surfaces. So I'll come up here, click on this icon, You have to select your two surfaces that you are comparing. You then have to either create or select a polyline in the drawing. I have already created a rectangular polyline that will form the basis of my grid. So I will click here, select my polyline. Okay, I can set my grid spacing. 20 by 20 is kind of tight. I'm going to do 100 by 100. Now, full disclosure, um, the larger the grids, the shorter this command will take. If you make your grids uh, very small, like let's say for instance, you take it all the way down to five by five, this is going to be a very long running command. I'm going to keep it at 100 by 100 and this command shouldn't take too long at all. Settings, if I come down here and click on modify, this is where you have control of your text height, text style, text placement in the grids even. You can control whether or not your volume text has a boundary around it. So once you get in here and set all of your styles how you want, as well as your text heights, you can then click on OK and click OK here. And the command will run. Just like that, that is my Earthworks plan production. Now, if I come back over here to my layer properties, now I've already done this on my drawing, but like I've shown you on the PowerPoint, you can easily create a layer filter in order to filter all of your Earthworks layers. Conveniently, these layers are created with EW. So you can very easily come in here, turn certain, you know, freeze certain entities, change cut the layer colors of other entities. You have complete control. Thank you for your time today.